Welcome back to the second half of Hacking Infinity, the Eschaton. So, uh, does anyone have a burning desire to go first? I mean, I have something in mind, but I, I don't want to, you know, <laughs> I don't want to hog the spotlight. <laughs> I've been going first the whole time, so if somebody else has an idea, like, they should go. Um, sure, I, I can go first. Okay. Um. So, uh, in going first, let me, uh, uh, if you could, uh, just kind of set the scene. What, what are you, what are you up to? What does, uh, your current environment look like? Um, uh, let me see. Do you, uh, let me look over your holding. Uh, uh, I'm so I have a spaceship. Mm -hmm. uh, I think. <coughs> Sorry. Okay. I think I'm about to land on Winter's planet. Okay. <laughs> have you filled out the forms? <laughs> yeah. Have you applied for permission to land? Um, or, or yeah, because I, I am unexpected in a sense that uh, okay. I am visiting uh, the the cult. Okay. I mean, we have paperwork for the uh, unexpected visitors as well. It's just <laughs> 10 times longer to fill out, um, you know, for the sake of necessity. Uh, so uh, what, is uh, your, what does your ship look like? Both like... Uh, Exterior and like the the specific uh, room that you're in. Um. So the the room that I'm in is we we see it on uh, like an infrared camera somewhere. The room is completely dark, and I'm sitting uh, at the captain's chair, or it looks more like a weird metal throne uh, and my tentacles are spread out into multiple connectors around the room but it's so it's not a it's not a large uh, cockpit thing with a bunch of people it's it's closet sized almost mm -hmm. or large closet sized but it like it's the nerve of operations of the ship um, and your tentacles and are all like uh, sticking into receptor, uh, like specific yeah. receptors for uh, that work uh, as controls. Yes, they are not like too prehensile. They don't grab things around and move. They they are sticking to uh, several ports around. Cool. Uh, and. Um, the ship from the outside, um, it's um, black metal, but rounded in almost insect-like, uh, well, like an insect shell, mm -hmm. like segmented. Um, it has some very because it has plus armed, it has some very mean looking perturbances here and there that uh, can mess things around. Um, yeah, and it basically looks like some sort of giant wasp, all black. Okay, cool. Um, so in a approaching a, a... Winter's Planet, does, uh, does it have a name? Or... Yes, Toxicis. Toxicis, <laughs> nice. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> uh, named after, you know, pretty obvious. <laughs> yeah, like that? Um, yeah. Don't matter, I... after System of a Down, obviously. They were all like, friends. Like, so I think I spell it, but yeah. Either way, it doesn't really matter. It's the pronunci oh, okay. pronunciation that really matters. <laughs> okay. 
And uh, do you want to pick a uh, 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 pick a spot where it's located in the uh, in the solar system? Sure. Um. So, in which solar system are we? Oh, I may have. Uh... Oh, whoops. Thing in the background. Oh. Okay. All right. Uh, um, so, uh, the, as, as you can uh, see there, there, there's like, uh, you can choose between uh, either a, uh, like, being a, a moon of a gas giant, uh, or a, a, you know, full planet. Yeah. Um, <clears throat> I think we're going to be a moon. Um, okay. On the... Um... Yeah, let's be in the inner parts. So we're we're on the most most inner gas giant. We're one of the moons. Um, uh, maybe that one. It looks particularly bright, which I imagine all the toxic plants are just you know. Um and uh, Kitsune, are are you are, are you making an attempt to uh? Uh, file all the proper paperwork, or are you just showing up and, uh... I am just showing up. I don't file paperwork. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> this is not, um... Filing very paperwork is for lesser beings? Yes. I mean, they should have known we were coming. It's all over the internet. <laughs> yeah. I mean, I'm sure we knew, but it's just somewhere, you know, in an office, lying on a pile, and it, with an inbox that's just, you know, two meters tall. Uh, so yeah, I, I think I'm. So how? I guess um, urban is your world because you have all the weird plants. Yeah. So. I think it's this sort of thing where um, we very much have to live with the f like the flora that exists here because it is tough and poisonous and like if you don't t like if you touch certain plants you might just go into like anaphylactic shock and die on the spot. So like it's very much like um, we have definitely cleared out paths, but we are like. In the like, it's it's a concrete jungle by both definitions, right? Like we are just smack down in the middle of plants everywhere, and they're like colorful, right? It, they come in all shapes and sizes and colors, um, and then there are just like segmented pathways that you can travel on and probably not get stung by one of these many plants that will kill you. And so, such is the advantage of having a smaller body on this planet, you know. Which is why we, you know, we advocate strongly to uplift yourself into the, into the body of a weasel. Uh, yeah. So I think the opening scene is like you see the, sh it's dusk. You see the ship going down uh, over the weird colored sky, purple, so maybe, mm. uh, and just. Everything over a, a small hill full of poisonous trees and just incinerating uh, a large chunk of land below her so she can put down with no regard for <laughs> wherever <laughs> permit yeah. you need to. Yeah. <laughs> so, so, so if I could add something, it's a little bit of flavor. It's that as you begin to incinerate the plants, they don't die as easily as you think they would, right? They just don't, like, catch fire, but they slowly, like, melt away, like, in a very strange way. Like, plants should not be that resilient to heat. <laughs> oh, and the fumes. Yeah, oh, yeah, and the fumes, right? Like, <laughs> there's just, like, a miles. weird cloud of, like, yeah, the nastiest stuff. Probably, like, blows into the ocean, right? Okay. Uh, uh, and I think I'm here to meet someone from the cult. 
for okay. some reason. Cool. Uh, let's, uh... Let's call them, uh... <coughs> Why am I picking a name that's going to be hard to pronounce? Because! Uh, Monotony. Monotonies. Why, why, okay, but uh, let's go with it. Uh, so, uh, Monotonies is, uh, uh, standing, uh, that, uh, right outside of the, the, uh, the danger zone. Um, uh, ready to, to accept your, your envoy. Um, and, uh, they, uh, uh, they are themselves in, in, uh, weasel form, uh, but, uh, uh, you, you, uh, may or may not suspect that, uh, you know, underneath the fur, it, it, it's not your normal, uh, uh, weasel uplift. Um... So, uh, do you, uh, are you expecting them to, uh, come onto your ship, or are you going out, or, uh, are you just, uh, landing and then, like, communicating over the, the mindscape, which is, uh, sort of like, uh, 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 the, like, psychic internet. Mindscape is a very good word. I like that. Um... It's actually stolen from somewhere else, but, uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Um, no, I think like the a bay door opens and there's a a message uh, going through the mindscape. Get in. Okay. Um, yeah. So they they uh, 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 they start to approach. Um, but uh so but uh you made no effort to like or or did you make any efforts to uh conceal this approach or uh uh yeah i think so like the the final touchdown was obviously we chose this spot because it's away from some sort of from civilization and the incineration part was more of over my disdain over the flora here and okay. why this this <laughs> Puny weasels didn't just uh, incinerate the entire planet and imported some more reasonable uh, <coughs> species over. <laughs> uh, so I think like we made an effort from going from orbit to atmosphere to uh, to be stealthy. Is there a role for that that you want? Yeah, yeah. Uh... Maybe, maybe an infiltrate. Yeah, I, I'm I'm thinking that uh, that infiltrate is probably the most appropriate. Um, I mean, you aren't specifically uh, uh, infiltrating, or, or are you in, in making contact with uh, uh, making contact here? Are are you trying to uh, uh, establish? Uh, I mean, is this someone who is? Uh, is is this member of the cult in uh integrated into uh winter society or are they sort of like uh separate from it and you and you're uh just uh yeah i think they are i think they are integrated okay okay so that that's definitely infiltrate um so uh go ahead and roll plus influence and, okay uh, well, now let me figure out what that is so it's minus one, but I have a few, right? Uh, 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 I think it's just minus one. Because I... Uh, I think it, I had something that bumped, bumped it up. Or down. I think I okay. I have. I think I deleted the part of text that I didn't want to. Uh, 
Um, where are my types of organism? Sorry. Uh, uh, no problem. Okay. Oh, so you have minus one to resist outside influence, or minus two. Uh, 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 but I think I had something from. Uh, Self-organizing. I had something from self-organizing, right? Uh, What's maybe? happening? Okay. Oh, sorry if I slid something. Uh... Okay. Yeah, I, I'm. Uh, I'm not seeing it. This, this is sort of pointing to a uh, uh, an excess of complication. Uh, but uh, let, let's just go ahead with the the minus one. Um, uh, just to, to uh, move things along. <laughs> uh, yeah, I, I'm not seeing any other modifiers, but it may, there may be one like hiding somewhere. I f wait. Uh, um... uh, now I'm hearing from someone else. <clears throat> hearing what? Great. Oh my. I was I was very yeah. Yeah. Very <laughs> Whatever soft. bonus there may have been, probably not gonna. <laughs> oh, it yeah. would not have helped. Uh, so uh, winter. Yeah. Uh, the uh, so the this uh, uh this cult that that uh has been uh totally flouting the rules um or attempting to i mean they they they've like filed some paperwork that's a little bit fishy uh uh has has set up this uh meeting that uh that you're totally aware of uh <laughs> Uh, how are you reacting to? Uh, how do you react to uh, when you, you know, as the the meeting is about to commence, they they like burn some of the planet and and land the, this uh, alien ship that has uh, that is, that is clearly well armed. Yeah, I mean, as far as the planet goes, good riddance. Do you know how difficult those plants are to kill? Like, <laughs> that's a lot of effort, right? Like, so that's just yeah, that's just a plus, but. As far as you know, having secret meetings in our in, in, on our world, that's just a no go. So clearly, we have the place like we 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 send out our own spies to spy on the meeting, right? And we want to be able to get all of the information that we possibly can from that. Um. And so, do I need to like make a roll, or uh, do I just? get to uh... um so the the failed role is enough for you to to definitely know that it's going on and uh have uh stuff in place to react to it yeah uh, how do you want to react i mean so initially not surface level not at all we want to spy on the the secret meeting we want to know what they are talking about right ah, information okay. is power and so we're going to be spying on the secret meeting okay uh so uh are you by by spying are you trying to uh like counter infiltrate yeah uh, probably okay <laughs> so that's an infiltrate then yeah Alright, um... That would be... It's a plus influence? Uh, indeed. Alright, and... I get a plus one, because of my... Uh... Oh? 
Oh, okay. There we go. So, uh, uh, tell me, uh, uh how this counter spying uh, looks like. Uh, uh, do you just, do you just have uh, bugs on uh, the representative? Did you like replace them with uh, um, your own person? What? Uh, how are you going about this? Yeah. So, so I think uh, there there's multiple parts to this. There's definitely like. A fully like uh, tracker GPS sort of system on on the uh, representative, right? Like the the weasel that may not be a weasel. Um, you know, they definitely have like some sort of listening device and tracking device on them. But there's also just like in the jungle, if like if you zoom back like 25 feet, there is just like 25 different like directed sound microphones and video cameras. Just point like this entire place is like. You just surveilled to to an extent, like to an extent that is probably unnecessary, but we are going to catch everything, right? Like, <laughs> okay. I mean, it needs to be uh, more than necessary because you you didn't know exactly what's the part of the jungle that that I would burn, so mm -hmm. you just knew yeah, a general I mean, area, and I burned three of the, of the microphones, but there are the we others. We may or may not have lost <laughs> half of the equipment in the initial landing, but, you know, still, it's, we were prepared for such losses. Okay. And uh, the uh, microphones and spying equipment, are they just, uh, are they just uh, essentially 20th century tech, or uh, uh, do you want them to oh. have, have, like, uh, uh, specific uh, uh, bells and whistles? Um, I mean, I, I think I think they're pretty like uh, nor like they're pretty normal uh, as far as we what we understand of listening devices and audio devices. Except everyone comes in like the form of an incredible colorful plant, right? Like there's just like <laughs> like th like there's like a rainbow plant that has like eight different colors on uh, on its um on its petals, right? And it's just like a camera that like keeps you know adjusting its zoom and zooming in and out. And then there's like a couple of a uh, colorful like a purple bug that like is actually just like a bug that is flying around, but it's uh -huh. like some sort of mosquito, right? Um, <laughs> that's hovering around the area. And, and so it's very much flavored to fit in with the local flora, right? Like it's all colorful and looks very, po like looks very toxic. Um, but other than that, it's mostly just like, maybe like some mindscape uh, surveillance as well, right? Like to uh, sort of see like communications packages that are being sent from one, 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 one user to another. Okay. Um, so, uh, I love where this is going, uh, uh, but, uh, let, let's go ahead and, uh, jump to, uh, either, uh, Shy, uh, or, uh, 3468, uh, whichever of you wants to, uh, uh actually, let's, uh, hmm, uh, yeah, yeah, e either one. Wh which of you wants to, uh, if you have, like, a, a specific interest in this, or if there's something else that you wanted to... Uh, I mean, I, I know where I am right now, but uh, I don't know if you have any ideas. Okay, so I am currently um, in one of Winter's, like, document warehouses with... <laughs> like the ridiculously biggest ass leaf blower that you can imagine <laughs> and i'm <laughs> i'm just pointing this thing as the, at this neatly stacked you know warehouse filled with documents you know trying to fiddle with the controls to get it working okay um interesting uh, I mean, you know, that that's where I want to be anyway. Like, you can, okay. you can, of course, I understand if I need to, you know, do a roll to get the hell in up there and then everything, but that's where I want to be anyway. Okay. And uh, do do you... Uh, I'm assuming you're not filing the, the appropriate paperwork. To, <laughs> <laughs> to I know, no, I, I left, like, a paper... Uh, like, what, Winter, what do you hate most? Like, I don't know, ponies or, like, rainbows or... What, what what do you what do you dislike most? Um, 
I mean, I, I think it's probably like uh, the rainbow, right? Because it just reminds us of all of the plants that we have to deal with on a daily basis. Okay, yeah. So, uh, so like, there's this like piece of paper with like a picture of a rainbow and like my signature under it, like mm -hmm. pinned to the front door, uh, as as by, by ways of paperwork, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> um, so, uh, for uh, how you get there, um, mm -hmm. there's a there's a number of different approaches you can take. Uh, you can just like uh, sort of barge your way in, uh, having uh, done like a uh, uh, like a, a drop from space or something like that. Um, you could try and sneak in. Uh, you could uh, uh, get a hold of or uh, rent uh, technology that's like, you know, sort of a transmat. Um, uh, uh, yeah, I think, I think I've just flown in here. I, I have my own spaceship as well. Uh, it's, it's one of those uh, cartoony small spaceships with like where the spaceship is this big and then the guns above the spaceship are like twice the size. <laughs> Um, so I, I think I would have <coughs> tried to stay on the radar for most of the bit, but last last bit I just flow flow in and point my guns at anything that tries to stop me, you know. Yeah, I mean I think as you reveal yourself, the first thing that happens is like your inbox plings, and there's like a, please fill out the forms if you wish to <laughs> perform an uh, perform an unplanned landing. <laughs> Thank you for complying with the rules and regulations. See the terms <laughs> and conditions, and it's just like a like a you know one terabyte data file. That's the terms and conditions, <laughs> right? Like <laughs> it it flew it floods like the yeah. the, the entire hard drive of my yeah. spaceship, where exactly. like stuff starts blinking and red yeah. lights start going on. <laughs> yep. And then you keep getting notifications about like you know forms you haven't filled it out. <laughs> I, I think I just, when that happens, I just smash the communication system of my ship. Yeah. <laughs> oh, and are you going in on your own, or do you have, like, uh, uh, there, there's I mean, definitely, I have, uh, uh, you know, I have there's a, a bit of a cult of personality around you, uh, so, you know, there, there's definitely volunteers who would love to come create chaos with you if you, if, if Oh uh, sure, yeah. I will, I will, I will have a, a couple of people, uh, you know, complete, like, anarchists, uh, that love to blow stuff up. Uh, they're probably, you know, setting fires to some houses right now somewhere in the neighborhood. <sighs> uh, right. I mean, you know, whatever they do is their own business, but they they tagged along anyway. Okay, so uh, yeah, you're definitely like on the planet, uh, running into uh, the uh, you know a warehouse full of important paperwork. Uh... <laughs> All paperwork is important. <laughs> well, yes, of course, of course. <laughs> I mean, else would usually like using a uh, it's not a bum, right? That I'm using. So usually this this is not my style, but I know that this would annoy Winter even more. So it's worth it. Yeah, nice. Um, so uh, is there uh, anything else you want to cover about the scene before we go to a, a roll to see how th this? Uh, you know that this uh, uh, chaotic affront goes. I, mean, I think that's it. I, I just show up with a giant leaf blower and <laughs> a bunch of crazy people. That okay. that that's about it. Uh, this looks like a direct conflict to me. Uh, <laughs> I mean, you know, <laughs> I, I am uh, my, my fault is that I'm pretty tactless, so that that you know might have to do with it. Oh, okay. So uh, definitely. Uh, uh, mark experience. Oh, okay. Uh, I see. I, I don't know how that works with faults. Uh, I just assumed okay. it was... Yeah, anytime you, you do something that uh, um, is, is uh, you know, that the, the fault would suggest you do, that uh, mm -hmm. either causes, that, that either, you know, like, uh, creates uh, difficulty... Yeah. <laughs> uh, the, the, it, it's worth experience, and you know, uh, this this definitely qualifies. I think. Okay. <laughs> Sweet. Uh, 
especially because uh, direct conflict is uh, uh, is hazardous, as you might imagine. I, mean, I yep. wouldn't do it if I wasn't. If it wasn't, right? <laughs> <laughs> Uh, okay, yeah. So how do I uh, do direct conflict? So, uh, roll uh, plus control, so that's uh, uh, 2d6 plus 1. Uh, uh, in, uh, unless you have uh, some modifiers. In, uh, uh, I don't see anything. Uh, that I've written down, uh, let's see, plus 2 to restructure, but I think that's a different kind of restructuring. <laughs> Yeah. Uh, yeah, no, I don't think I'm fermenting rebellion, so I think it's just uh, plus one. Okay. A nine. Okay. Um, so, uh, let me... Uh, Okay, and uh, are are you trying to cause so much chaos that it that uh, that uh, it, it completely throws uh, uh, Winter's organization into chaos, uh, or are you is this just like a a, 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 a bit of I mean, fun? I mean, I'm but just trying to spite Winter. If this would be that, that's up to Winter, really. Like, if is this something that would throw your yeah, your organization like, into chaos, or would they just benefit from the fact that everybody then has to? I'm sorry, uh, your form got lost. You have to fill it out again. I mean, there's both advantages and disadvantages <laughs> to having incredibly disorganized paperwork, right? That's why we have very elaborate systems of, you know, putting them in boxes and then hiding them at the back of the warehouses in order to not find them when they're needed. Um, <laughs> so I, I, I think. I think you are definitely causing some chaos, but if you're only like you know making paperwork even more disorganized, I don't think it's necessarily like incredibly yeah. harmful if it's just like a few warehouses, right? Like if it if it starts to be like all paperwork, then that might be a problem. But you know, no, I mean you can't like I, I'm I'm pretty small scale in that sense. You can't point, uh, you know. Uh... I, I definitely picked the biggest warehouse, but you know, I'm just one person pointing a, a gigantic uh, yeah. But but I think the, these the, blowers. So. Yeah, but in the biggest warehouse, we also put everything that we don't want organized, right? Because that's what we <laughs> just shove everything into, and and so it's... you probably picked the best target. You might actually end probably, up organizing yeah. our paperwork <laughs> even more, which might actually be a problem for us in the long run. <laughs> because I mean, we... sure. <laughs> Uh, yeah, so I'm, I'm just no, so I'm not I'm not derailing uh, Winter's civilization just yet. Hmm. Okay. Uh. So. I think what I'm uh. I, I think rather than a clock that ends in the uh, target organization and uh, lo no longer being able to effectively oppose you, uh. We should call it a. Uh, uh, I mean, it can be part of a bigger clock, right? I mean, like yeah. my next step is to find like uh, Winter's most prized possessions and set oh. fire to them. Oh, okay, I, so I this, mean, is, it, this is just your, the first step in in, in a campaign. Oh yeah. Okay. okay. <laughs> is this a personal vendetta or is it like against <laughs> yeah. my people? Okay, so so maybe the clock should be to you know make my day miserable, right? Like. <laughs> I mean, you know, what whatever works for you as as as, lo as long as I make you miserable. I mean, you know, if if upsetting your society makes you miserable, sure. But yeah, I mean, to some degree it does. But also, you know, like I, I look up for number one first, right? You would know that <laughs> as my previous best best friend. So <laughs> yeah, so so my clock, I guess, is to to ruin winter's day then. Okay. Um. Well, um, do you want to be, uh, when you fill it out, do you want to be in a position to uh, uh, ruin Winter's Day sort of at will? Uh, or is it just you want to ruin this one day? Uh, I mean, I just, I just want to ruin, like, I, I, no, I, I want it to be a big thing, right? I want to I wanna make, like, Winter, like, 
so pissed off that I don't know. He he comes to my planet without filling out any paperwork and points a gun at me or something along okay, those yeah, lines. Okay, yeah. That, okay, that's. Yeah. Uh, I I think uh, doing that would would be uh, effectively schism. I mean that that would be <laughs> a, a change in how uh, you know the Winter's organization works and and goes about doing <laughs> things. So yeah, okay. Uh, so uh yeah like i i, I want to make I'm, i i want to make like that's my goal i want to make winter so so pissed that he becomes violent because that was why he was boring right i'm just i'm just helping him making it, making it more interesting okay i mean there's so much paperwork involved in hurting people right there's so much <laughs> to do to steal things we've streamlined the stealing we're working on killing <laughs> <laughs> You're doing bureaucratic overhauls. Yeah, but you know it takes time, and paperwork is lost. And now, with particularly, there's like a whole warehouse upside down. <laughs> okay, so uh, you are uh, a quarter of the way towards uh, when. Uh, Winter's organization going uh, uh, involuntarily violent. <laughs> uh, Sweet. Well, okay. Uh, yeah, yeah. We'll, we'll just go with that. Uh, now, uh, since this was a seven to nine, uh, choose one. Uh, either uh, uh, your organization uh, loses one morale, uh, your uh, want is activated. Uh, or you gain a new want that is, is not yet uh, active. Uh, I mean, I what what what? How, how does the wants thing work? Um, so uh, in the because I, I like I I don't be all for losing morale because who cares about morale? <laughs> but I, I mean... um, it doesn't make sense because this would just make them happy. <laughs> yeah, yeah. But but if morale is sort of like your HP, then maybe it's the fact that, you know, a lot of your followers, they see plants that they think that they can, like, you know, get high on, and they start touching things, and they just, like, go into, like, you know, they start getting poisoned, essentially. I mean, so, perhaps, but I also want to know what this one thing is. Yeah. Okay. Uh, so let me see what... Uh, uh... Yeah, I don't actually have a want and a surplus because there was nowhere was any like description of that I should get it. It was just you have a surplus and a want. Oh, okay. So yeah, let let's pick one. Uh, let's pick a couple to uh, or one of each to start, and then uh, if you want it, uh, and then depending on that, you'll either uh, activate the want or uh, pick a new one. So uh, in the handouts, there's a surplus and want. Uh, it's at the the top of the handouts. Oh, here, yeah, right. Okay. Oh. And you know what? It occurs to me that I forgot to do uh, to have uh, you citizens uh, do a uh, roll at the beginning of the session to. Uh, Oh, I like definitely like my surplus is violence. Yeah. Plus one to direct <laughs> conflicts while active. I mean, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> violence. Uh, so my want is there some kind of? I mean, I would suggest savagery. Uh, where's no. savagery? Uh, near the bottom. Oh here. <laughs> yeah, when active, uh, roll act under pressure. I'm gonna hit choose, yeah. Flame. I mean, savagery works for me, sure. Okay. Um. So, uh, do you want to lose uh, one of your four morale? Um, no, uh, no, no. Like, I'll activate a check sec or uh, add a, a second one. I'm gonna activate savagery because that makes sense. My guys are having a lot of fun here. Well, maybe a little bit too much. Okay. I mean, you know, not from my point of view, but someone might, you know, objectively say that they are having too much fun. Okay. Cool. 
Uh, roll another. Uh, 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 roll uh, plus badass. I mean, I'm pretty badass, so uh, let's do that. Oh, two D. This is the, the acting under uh, acting under pressure. No problem. Okay. Uh, so okay. on a hit, choose anxiety, desertion, desperation, blame, and nationalism, and apply those results. Uh, so I choose one. Yes. I mean, you know, can I can I choose desperation, but voice it a little different? Like desperation, when active, any organization uh, move miss causes the population to do something really stupid. Uh huh. Uh, not because of desperation, just because you know they're they are. not very <laughs> clever. <laughs> sure, sure. Okay, so that basically means they do something stupid now. Uh, no, no, you haven't missed the uh, you you haven't missed a roll. You the you know it was a success, okay. and this is going forward. But uh, okay, yeah. yeah. Now for the rest of the session, anytime you do miss uh, when you're doing a uh, an organization move. Your people are going to they do, do something, something stupid. Something. I mean, that makes sense. Yeah. That makes a lot of sense. <coughs> Should we make so, a roll now? Um, so, uh, your uh, 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 Winter, you're, you're definitely getting information that there, there's like this uh, chaos starting up in uh, 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 in a second location. Um, However, yeah. however, uh, in addition to that, uh, thirty-four sixty-eight. You, uh, uh, I, I, I think that. Uh, well, I mean, you, you have a person stationed on, uh, uh, on Winter's uh, uh, world toxicis uh, already, right? Yep. Okay. Um. So, uh, you can either proceed with, like, some, uh, like, some basic knowledge that something is up, uh, or if you want, uh, just, like, uh, starting out the scene, uh, you can do, uh, an assess, um, or, or, uh, something along those lines to to see what you know about uh, the unfolding situation. So now is this okay? But do I do I know that she's attacking the planet? Is that clear, or is that do I have to roll assess to get that? Uh, you you need to roll assess. Uh, if, okay. if you don't, yeah. If you don't do an assess. Uh, 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 right That's on the outside idea. here, then it, it's more of a, uh, you know that uh, there's uh, something going on, some sort of disturbance, but not... <laughs> you're you're not screaming in explosions. <laughs> uh, so, focus, alright, I can do that, no problem. And I get bonuses, I believe. No. Because I have mass for, uh, you get to spend one rep to assess any person or location you're aware of. Uh, so whether you have an agent there, someone um, start. Okay. So uh, uh, yeah, you you don't actually need to uh, uh, spend a temporary rep here since uh, I, you do have uh, you do have a, someone who's uh, could be on the scene. It's not like okay. out in the middle of uh, nowhere. Um, okay. But it is possible that you have uh, other bonuses. Okay. Um, all right. Here we go. Sweet. Nice. Almost max. Okay. I didn't have a minus one. Are you you pl plus minus one or like plus one? It's it's minus one. Okay. <laughs> uh, okay. Well, that's the way it works in the system. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, okay. It, it works see. if you do a plus minus one or minus one. Yeah. Okay. So, uh, 
you can uh, ask a question from the list right now. You, you gain two hold, so you can uh, uh, ask a question from the list right now, uh, and uh, then either ask a follow up or save it for uh, you know, uh, save it for a little later. Um. So. What is the biggest threat in this situation? Okay. Uh, so the the biggest threat I I think is definitely that uh, what uh, you 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 are aware that uh, uh, that uh, shy is, is uh, like. Just out of the blue, directly attacking uh, uh, Winter's uh, uh, bureaucratic infrastructure, uh, and th there's a chance that that will spiral out of control, uh, uh, causing not only uh, uh, not only. Uh, Winter to change uh, to a, a more aggressive stance, but uh, just uh, the fact that Shy's people are in conflict it is likely to uh, uh, cause them to start more conflicts. Mm -hmm. All right. Um... Hmm. Well, and also I want to uplift that those creatures on that planet, and so if she destroys everything, then that might put a kick in my knees. So, um, so Winter is not my ally, but I don't want to get squashed by two people attacking him at once, and I feel like uh, I need to do a power play here and swing balance back into his favor. And so that he doesn't completely get squished like a bug. But I also I mean, want to be, learn his lesson in a, in a kind of way. Um, so I'm going to... Um, do, 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 do. Okay. And you're, you're holding on to the, the, the second question for, for later, or do you, want to, uh, do you want to ask that right now? No. Uh, where can I gain the most advantage as far as... Hurting Shy's efforts in attacking Winter. Hmm. Uh, I mean, I imagine my ship is unguarded right now. Because everybody's having too much fun blowing stuff up and, you know, blowing paperwork into the air. Like, I'm, I'm trying to put in as much effort as I can to blow stuff out of the door and onto the street. <laughs> uh... I imagine like some like some some person in like official like clothing is running around panic trying to get ga gather all the the uh, the uh, yeah. pieces of paperwork. Yeah, the, the, there's like an old weasel that's like following you around trying to hand you a load of paperwork. That's like if if you want to cause public destruction, you have to fill out these forms, right? Like. <laughs> Trying to convince you to, you know, pay attention. I, I mean, I give the thing a threatening look, and I pretend to point my gigantic leaf blower at it. Uh, yeah, I mean, it, it's probably not like they probably run away, right? They're not very brave. <laughs> yeah. But they, they probably like leave the pile of paperwork. <laughs> uh, so yeah, uh, I, I would make sure to leave my footprint on it. Uh, so yeah, their uh, uh, ship is unguarded. And some of the the uh, 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 this war party, if, if they were aware that the the ship was like starting to take off, or uh, uh, or somebody else was grabbing it, that would like distract them, and they they some of them would probably come running back. Um, or there may be other ways you could take advantage of that that situation. No, I think that's. Oh yeah, good. like the the ship is unguarded I because I instructed a... them to watch it, but they were like, "Fuck that! <laughs> if she's having fun, I'm having fun too." So definitely, they so would perfect. come to deal with it. Like, oh fuck, we we failed our job. Right. So I feel that falls under steal something valuable. Oh so yeah. <laughs> I'm going to steal their ship. Okay. <laughs> Damn you. <laughs> 
<laughs> that's pretty. I go, uh, you know, so I picture me sitting there on uh, my key, my uh, big old keyboard with my eight monitors. It's like, Agent 3962, go, go ahead. Okay. Uh, yeah, there's a big problem going down here, boss. Uh, looks like there's uh, several uh, casualties of paperwork. This is a tragedy for all paperwork kind. Um, these four pieces of paper didn't know what was coming to them. I was like, okay, okay, stop the dramatics there, son. Um, what's going on? Well, boss, uh, um, Miss Shy has come over here and caused chaos, and it looks like there, she's trying to advert the, uh, cause the people to, uh, to become aggressive, and that might, uh, subvert the, uh, Asgraft. Roger that. Well, it looks like their ship's unguarded, so I think we should take it. All right, permission to acquire ship. We'll hold it as ransom if need be. Okay. I boss on it, and it switches over to. That's uh, good. Okay. So uh, first off, uh, let's do an infiltrate roll to get onto the ship without being noticed. I, I think that should be a little easier than usual. Yeah, yeah. Since um, my guys are just enjoying right. themselves, right? <laughs> yeah. So, uh, yeah, get an extra plus one. Uh, someone's uh, at the door. Or do you I'm think sorry. it... it uh, or... Um, uh, someone's Shai, at the door. Do you door. think it, the, the, the situation is such where they can infiltrate the ship without any problem? It, it, it's not even... Uh, it's, it's I not mean, they probably can just take the ship. I mean, they, they'd have to argue... Like, the problem would be more with the weasels who are trying to give the ship tickets, probably. <laughs> Uh, saying that you're not allowed to take this ship right now because it's yeah. under quarantine or something. But yeah. the problem would definitely not be with me. <laughs> okay. yeah, I mean, the, the, yeah. there is proper forms you have to fill out in order to steal things, right? They're very easy. It's like one it's like one paper sheet, right? And so, it all requires like a signature. But... Sorry about that. Someone's at my door. I gotta go in. Oh. Sorry. Okay. Go ahead. I'm sorry. I didn't know someone was coming. My bad. No, no problem. Um, so, uh, in the meantime... <laughs> uh let's see uh uh kitsune uh you uh have uh, uh you uh you have uh made successful so it seems uh contact with uh this uh uh, uh monotonies uh you and uh they uh uh, and, unless you're uh, uh, suddenly changing your mind, they, they uh, 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 walk on board your uh, ship and uh, uh, and are uh, yeah. ready to uh, uh, give you either a report on the situation or uh, uh, or, into, or to inquire as to what you want them to do next. Uh, what do you want to do? Uh, I think first of all, as I enter the atmosphere, I I feel the entire mindscape of this place flow through me, and I would like to search it. Hmm. Sounds good. Uh, okay, I have a. Uh, this is synthesis, right? So I have a yeah. plus two. And I don't think I have anything else. Oh, I'm very good today. <laughs> oh, dear. Um, wow. Okay. Uh, well, uh, go ahead and mark experience for that and for the, uh, the fail earlier. Ah, okay. Um... Uh... And uh, so I, do you I want? Don't... Uh, uh, do you want me to answer a uh, question anyway? Uh, uh, or uh, okay, well I I, I will still I, I will... when it's your question I will still answer it, uh, and you can decide uh, whether uh, it I don't have to answer yeah, it accurately thinking... or whether uh, I answer it accurately and make a move. Uh. <laughs> 
So my question is, where would I find my the my missing cyber DNA? And go ahead and make your move. <laughs> I want a, a clear answer on this. Okay. Uh, so, uh, Winter, where are you keeping that that uh, that DNA? Um, I mean, it's it's what it's in one of the hidden like um, like laboratories um, that like we have like just just underground. Um, it's probably you know just just outside the the main the main city. Um, but yeah, it's it, it's it's in we're, since we're trying. It, yeah, it's this sort of like weird lab- laboratory where we're, you know, manipulating both DNA and uh, you know um, data, right? And we're trying to create our own hybrid creature. And our initial successes are limited at best. Um, <laughs> so so there, 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 there is this like whole like uh, like uh, version 1.0, and it's it, it's probably just like a chunk of metal with like some like goo on it and we're not quite sure what that was right but then the, it goes down a few generations and it looks a little bit better but we're nowhere near um you know reaching any functional sort of um uh, you're trying to reverse engineer whatever i am yes but without actually making you right like that's a problem we ran into very early on where like it's easy to make another copy of you but that's another copy of you, and we don't need that, right? We need another copy of you that isn't you. So we need to pull you out of your own DNA, which is more yeah, complicated so, than one would think. <laughs> so I think the, the way that it went was you got a hold first of a few of my brain implants, microchips, and you thought, huh, if I just put this in the brains of some people or some weasels, uh, they will just be their own hive mind and they just turn at you and they were part of my um <laughs> um ho- ho- collective not collective yeah ah, i'm missing the word um okay. uh, composition yes yes yeah, I mean, so those weasels were unfortunately had had to be put down because of complications. You know, the, <laughs> the, the, those brave weasels, uh, you know, got new bodies eventually, but it, it took it took a few years because the paper. I mean, they, they did sign the the form, the oh, yeah, disclaiming responsibility for what would have happened, and mm-hmm, so it's yeah. fine. And they were insured that they they'd be uplifted again, right? Like we'd you know print them into a new body, and that, that's all good. But you know, um, they temporarily lost uh, lost their sanity. Okay. Uh, yeah. So uh, so as the guy is coming in, I I'm we see um. It's soon just a, a wall that now we know it's a door, but it it was just a blank piece of uh, metal. There's no reason why you would suspect that that particular section of wall would be a door. Slides and Kitsun uh, walks out. Uh, it's uh, it's a kind of a weird uh, walk, the, a weird um, movement, uh, as some of the tentacles on the back of the skull are still connected to somewhere in the other room. Um, come in, little friend. I have a job for you. And I like start showing on uh, some hollow panel, like the location that I want him to, to go to. Of course, we would be happy to uh, assist in your uh, uh, investigation. Um, but. Uh, there, there is the uh, uh, as you know, uh, uh, our efforts to uh, 
spread the uh, the faith of uh, uh, Shub Shub Nagara uh, on uh, Toxesis have have run into a number of uh, difficulties. The the local government is uh, uh, resistant. Perhaps you could provide uh, some assistance so that we can better assist you? Of course. What would you need? Well, uh, let me see. <laughs> like a, 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 a torch to, to burn all the paperwork? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, if you want to burn it, you have to find it first, you know? <laughs> it's all over the place now. <laughs> there's a th there's advantage in this organization. Um, let me see. I, I think that... We, uh, we could use, uh, uh, most specifically, some, uh, uh, specialized, uh, nanotech. We, we will handle the, the, the programming side of it, but, uh, we do need, uh, the, uh, the, uh, Assembled bots, and we'll, we'll uh, we can handle the software. Um, do I have nanobots of some description? Uh, quite possibly. Uh, what is your rep? Uh, uh, uh it starts at three, and I get plus one. F for open society. Okay. Um, so uh, to provide it uh, would be a uh, uh, convenient acquisition role. Um, and uh, I uh, believe you'd be doing that at uh, plus one. Uh, well, it's specialized. Uh, so uh, it would be an even role. So, um, zero. Okay. Is that so, what you mean? So, what is my rep again? Like mechanically? Uh, so your so your rep is uh, four. It starts at three, and you get a plus one from Open Society. Um, and uh, yeah, but what does it represent? Oh, uh, mechanically, it's, it, it, it's sort of money. Um, oh, okay, it's yeah. barter. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Oh, and I should also mention that... Uh, ooh, uh, uh, You're so getting that Mark XP. Experience again. You, uh, you only need five to, to do an advance. Uh, <laughs> wow. Uh... I, I should mention that when you were uh, looking on the uh, uh, looking through the mindscape for uh, information on your uh, uh, stolen DNA, uh, there there was a, 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 just a, a a shiver ran along some of your like uh, uh, you know. Uh, Mine, you, you like uh, the the smallest of your tentacles that that uh, that often accompanies uh, a, a premonition that that something is going wrong, but uh, you didn't notice anything bad happening exactly. Got the information, so it must be all okay, right? Uh, so um, yes, sure. <laughs> <laughs> uh. So I think that uh yeah, yeah, uh you uh 
you just, uh, I mean, you could probably, uh, you could get a hold of the Nano at, at uh, uh, you know, uh, uh, given time, or if you just, like, uh, uh, yeah, I, I, I want this done back, now. But yeah, you don't you don't have it right now, um, and you know leaving and coming back could be a problem. <laughs> yeah, so I think I I say to him, the entering your own facilities should not be a problem if you do bring me uh, the data that I'm missing I can easily further your connection with that who, who you wish to serve and I'm trying to manipulate him I yeah. guess because I want to fill more roles. <laughs> you want to level up. You know? Yeah. It's, you don't have that many moves for me to pick yet. That's going to be a problem because I'm going to level up like four times in this session. Um, yeah, um, well, we, can, we can create... Uh, no, I'm, I'm, I'm kidding. Yeah, <laughs> uh, on this one, I do have a plus... Oh, I figured out where the rest of the self-organizing text was on your uh, it's not on your handout but on your uh, Google Doc thing oh. uh, you have the full thing so I've copied it over and so self-organizing is use seduce or manipulate with a plus one bonus to give commands oh yes okay. this uh, I... okay. I actually did well, something. Wow. Okay. <laughs> well, awesome. Um. So. Uh, yeah. Yeah. The. Uh, of course. Of course. Uh, that would be uh, most welcome. I'm. I'm. I'm sure we can manage. Uh, thank you. Uh, thank you, Katsumi. You are. Uh, I kind of. Uh, so I reach my my hand into his head and like I don't know if I can yeah I, I give him a taste of the connection I guess like to prove my point okay uh, so uh, winter mm -hmm. uh, you are uh uh, watching this go down, uh, yep. as well as watching uh, chaos unfold at, at, at one of your your largest facilities, and and yes, uh, having uh, papers, uh, uh, you know, having excuse for certain papers being lost is, is helpful, but uh, this way you can't write, uh, you know, no one has authorized. Uh, a paper disbursement of this sort. I mean, uh, that is true. <laughs> and, and uh, you know, the officials in charge on uh, on site are definitely in a tizzy, um, and uh, are 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 uh, you know already filing the 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 forms for uh, uh, to initiate a, a, a violent reprisal. But mm -hmm. you know, they haven't heard back yet. Uh, yeah, I mean, I think I, we're just watching like um, Winter finish up the paperwork for the the you know the the violent response back, um, and the the you know there's this a fat stack of papers, and he's like writing with like a, a fury uh, that that only a, a very very seasoned bureaucrat can achieve, right? And <laughs> and, and then afterwards, it's just like it's all done, and then it's just like a a, a big like. Um, a big stamp that just like go down, goes down on it, and then like hands hands it over, and then it's like send it send in the weasels, and then like hand over the paperwork to some to some like weasel in like a suit, right? That has like black black glasses on, and you stand there looking looking very like spec ops. <laughs> <laughs> um, and 
So yeah, I, I like I want to uh, you know cause some direct direct conflict. I think uh, with, uh, <laughs> with 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 the uh, with the uh, with the hooligans. All right. <laughs> um, I knew you had it in you. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I mean, you didn't is, need to fill out that that, all... uh, that clock. Uh, Th- this is all about and... board. Though. You already got it. <laughs> <laughs> the, the, this is all about board. You know, this is all sta- you know the eyes are dotted and the, everything's yes. properly performed. Uh, want... uh, yeah, like I, I will, I will only be fully happy if if you just if you if you forget the paperwork and just come over and sh- shoot yeah. at me. And and for, and for that you need you need to you know make me a little <laughs> bit more mad. But but it's an, a wonderful start. So, okay, sorry. and and uh, so, uh, what are you trying to uh, uh, achieve? Are you just trying to like uh, kill them all so that they can't cause any more damage, uh, uh, or do you I'm want to arrest to... them or something yeah, else? Yeah, I'm trying. I'm trying to primarily arrest. Like lethal force is allowed, but it's the final. Like you know, it's it's the whole like we're still the police, right? Like we shoot if we have to, but not open fire immediately, right? And okay. so I. I believe it's still, a, you know, preferably non-lethal measures. Uh, and, and I mean, it would be wonderful if you caught Shy and gave her this gigantic stack of papers that she had to fill out if she wanted yeah. to leave prison, right? Yeah, I mean... right? Like, I, 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 I won't even put you in prison because I'll put you in a holding cell that where you have to fill out forms in order to go into prison, right? <laughs> like... Yeah, you're free to go as, at any time as soon as you fill yeah. out this. Yeah. And then literally just like six boxes of paperwork. <laughs> uh, I mean, wonderful. <laughs> all right, let's see. Uh, there are conflicts. Mm. Control is. I feel like this minus. system is very good for chaos. Um, like you, 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 you create maximum chaos with very, very few amount of rolls. <laughs> Oof! I mean, yeah. <laughs> my my weasel spec up teams. They go in and they they do the job. They do it clean. They do it neat, right? Okay. By the books. Yeah, by the books. Everything. Wh- wh- which is which is multiple, right? There there's actually yeah. like a couple of shelves of but, books. But they, but they do it by all of the books, right? Like, <laughs> all fifty of them are followed to the letter. Oh, all right. Um. Let me. Okay, and our uh, so you what you're trying to achieve is just to uh, arrest them. I'm not... trying, yeah, I'm trying to cause like get order back into my <laughs> okay into my town, right? So uh, arresting them. Okay, but and, and you're not trying to uh, like destabilize further destabilize Shai's uh, organization, just just uh, get control no, of these. No, I'm. Yeah. <laughs> I'm just trying to keep my status quo, right? Like, and you know, if we capture 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 a few important member of her um, of her like organization, we might be able to squeeze a secret or two out of them, you know, in in our secret holding cells. Um. Okay. <laughs> so the question is, are you going after Shy as well? Um, yeah. I mean, if, if like, I'm not certain Winter is fully aware that like you're there, like personally just yet, like because he's he's in this like op center right where he's like mm-hmm. primarily watching like the the, um, the spy meeting um that's going on in this weird alien ship right but he's also like you know on two other screens there's like the whole chaos that you're causing <laughs> but there's just paper everywhere right so it's like kind of difficult even for uh, like even for our like super advanced like security systems to catch and like do facial recognition so like i'm not quite certain winter knows that it's you just yet but definitely know there are some hooligans causing causing papers <laughs> to go everywhere. Okay. So I, I think that this is uh 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 this would just be like a, a, a dual clock, so you, you, you just you just do the thing. Uh yeah. and uh so you uh Shy, you, you have a, a leaf blower rather than your usual rockets. Uh which is a, a bit of a problem when, when yeah, <laughs> uh, like I mean, this thing puts out some serious power, but yeah. it doesn't exactly blow people up, right? They can yeah. just get up again afterwards and try again. <laughs> uh, 
So, uh, it, it's not the best situation when, like, a, a hundred weasel police show up with, uh, you know, both tasers and uh, some sort of... Uh, very very heavy books to whack with? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, probably, probably a couple of flashbangs as well. Uh, so, uh, you have a... Uh, uh, you have a choice, though. Uh, like, some of the, the people that uh, came with you are going to get, like, uh, tasered and captured. Um, but uh, you personally... Um, you, uh, could, like, just, uh, like, suicide right now, and just wake back up on your planet, and, uh, you know, uh, you're, you're, you know, you lost some people, but, you know, there's more of those. Um, but you might lose something else along the way, in terms of, like, memories. I mean, what, what I would uh, like most is if I uh, could get captured, but... Maybe, you know, maybe um, st still be in a position to potentially escape from whatever prison they have me in. So maybe have like a tech gadget hidden under my skin that I can pull out to try and escape. Oh, for sure. Uh, but I'd be all for just getting caught. I mean, you okay. know. So, so maybe there's a scene where there's like ten little like weasels in suits that are like slowly approaching you with tasers. They all like shoot you and you just like get electrified and like scream in rage <laughs> as you like blow all of them down. And then another like twenty comes rushing up and like you jump on you and you're just in this pile of weasels. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Totally. Yeah. <laughs> nice. Okay. Um So, uh let's see, where were we? With uh, uh, 3468. Um, I uh, infiltrated the ship. Sorry about that. Someone. Oh. I know. No Somebody was not. Off. Sorry about that. Um, so, uh, yes, I infiltrated the ship. So I rolled. I made success on that, I believe, because I rolled 11. Or... Okay. No, my, that was my success. So I was going to roll to infiltrate the ship. Okay. Um, yeah, like I said, you you probably don't even need to roll. Um, um as at least as, uh, unless unless Winters people are trying to get the ship as well. I mean, I think there's like you know three or four parking maids just standing there, like writing tickets for like every violation ever, as you <laughs> park parked not only illegally but also unauthorized and in probably on top of something, right? Like you didn't <laughs> like you didn't actually yeah, just park okay. as much as just like crush something. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, totally. Uh, so maybe that's they're, they're the complication. Just, okay, but they're just marking the infraction of the 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 ship uh, landing there illegally. They're they're not like they aren't trying to take control of it or, or keep anybody from entering. I mean, or, or those are processes they? have begun, right? But it takes a little while for the paperwork to come through. Okay. So <laughs> I think it's more like I I might be aware that someone steals the ship rather than like I'll be able to stop him from doing so. Okay. So, yeah, yeah, I, I don't think you need to make a uh, roll to either uh, get on the ship or steal it. You just, uh, you know, you, you, you uh, enter it, and uh, uh, your, uh, your agent is, is uh, plenty tech-savvy. They know how to operate it. So, uh, yeah, what do you want to do with it? Oh, still, um, so I stole it, no roll, I need it? Yeah, yeah. Well, that was <laughs> that's a little. <laughs> I'm like, well, um, hmm. um, oh, yes, yes. Well, okay. Uh, In, unless you want I, to get I on know the ship. That... Uh, well, what? I guess one caveat. Uh, do you want to get on the ship without uh, Winter's people knowing that you got on the ship and that you're the one stealing it? Yes, I don't want my agent to be Okay. Bad. Okay. So, so yeah, go ahead and roll steal something valuable. Okay. So that's uh influence, I got plus two, and I get another plus one, I believe. No. Oh we have plus two, okay. Just a plus two. Okay. 
No, nice. no problem. Love it. Okay. Uh, right. So you still need to make uh, some uh, choices. Uh, the uh, so uh, uh, of the you know you get three of these. So uh, choose the one that you don't get, which is the the agent escapes uh, with the ship. The ship is undamaged. Um, nobody. Uh, 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 there, there isn't some sort of like uh, tracer or, or compromise, uh, and think, uh, 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 getting like extra information. Yeah, I don't think uh, getting extra information was our goal, so I will take that out. Cool. Okay. I didn't get any extra information from the ship. Okay. So you you grab the ship clean. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Nobody knows that that uh, your organization is involved. And you've uh, got the ship. Okay, and now I know that uh, the mother ship is here, right? Um, well, you do have a. Uh, I think you or did you use you did use the other hold. Um. Uh, yes, I did. I'm sorry. Okay. Okay. Damn it! I didn't know mother was there. So I don't know mother's uh, there. So uh, well, uh, you you can know that. You can uh, go ahead. Uh, so your uh, agent on the scene was, was uh, engaged uh, in the ship thing, um, but if you wanted to uh, use that uh, mass surveillance mo uh, move, uh, you can uh, roll an assess of the uh, of the uh, uh, Katsuni situation as well, if you wish. All right. Let me do that then. Okay. Sorry, don't okay. make a pickup. So, uh, make a note that your uh, rep is uh, uh, down one for the rest of the session. Got it. Uh, which is now, which they have a lot. <laughs> yeah. Um, okay, got it. Okay. Uh, rep is now. I got it. Doesn't say what my rep started with though. Uh, uh, base would be three, and then it's modified by uh, th there's a move that will in that increases your uh, effective rep, uh, and then the organizational tags can can modify it as well. Right. All right. Um. So yeah. All right. Got it. Okay, got it. Okay. Huh. And I need to roll, right? Uh, yes. Uh, focus. Oh. That was not good. Not good. Oh my. I failed. I think. Okay. Uh, your, your your focus is, is uh, uh, zero. <laughs> Um, I think I messed up on that. It's a minus one. Oh, okay. Yeah, so that's a five. So yeah, I failed. Okay. Uh, so uh, you have a choice of uh, uh, you hesitate while assessing and miss something in, uh, important or lose an opportunity. Uh, or I can answer your question anyway. Uh, but uh, the answer may be a little bit misleading. Possible. Answer my question anyway. Okay. What what is your question? Um. Did did I know of any other threat besides um, shy on the planet? Ah yes. Well, let me see. Uh. You uh. Uh, yeah, you you have some uh, uh, some satellites in uh, uh, like far orbit around uh, Toxesis, uh that pick up some uh, 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 some signal traffic uh, that seems to be indicating that. Uh, 
that there is a, uh, uh, that there's a, uh, about to be a move on a, uh, uh, ooh, uh, uh, a move on a facility, uh, you're, you're not sure what, uh, uh, what the details of it are exactly, um, but, uh, in trying to get more information out of it, your uh, your friends over in special circumstances are uh, saying that uh, 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 extracting it for your uh, um, uh, extracting it for yourselves would uh, uh, you know, and, and then of course sharing the, the information with them uh, would be a. a uh, Great course of uh, uh, action that would uh, 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 benefit interagency cooperation overall. Hmm. So um, they want me. So I, I think someone's going to steal something, or like attack something. Uh, you're, you're, uh, it's not exactly clear what uh, uh, what form the extraction is uh, uh, is going to take or, or plan to take. It, it could be a steal. It could be a smash and grab. What kind? Of, okay, so. What's the best way to help them then? To um, steal it for them? They want me to steal this then, right? Uh, yeah, they're, they're saying that it'd be, uh, uh, that, uh, if, uh, you can extract it yourself or, or use whatever agents are, are coming at it to, to, uh, as cover, uh, uh, extract it. That would be great. Okay, um, I think I'm going to use Shy Ship and uh, to steal this Damn it. object. And um, I'm going to, but I'm going to use. Um, I guess that would be um, continue undermining winter in a way, if that's the case, because I'm pushing Shy's objective, because I'm falsely putting her down. Does that make sense or no? Oh, you can totally do that. All right. <laughs> so I by mean, me I stealing object. this, I'm going to continue undermining. You, you get style points. No, I'm no, I'm going to steal this, and this continues to undermine Winter, which uh, moves your clock forward. So I'm I'm trying I'm pushing Winter to to assault you. Yeah. To to lose control. Yeah, to lose control. All right. Um. That's, that sound good? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I think you can do that. I, I think that uh, definitely makes sense within the fiction. Um, so, uh, let, let's, uh, well, let's do the continue undermining first, uh, since, uh, you're using that to provide the, the cover for, uh, uh, extracting the, the DNA, right? Yeah, exactly. Sounds good. Okay. Boom! Nice. Harsh. Okay. So, uh, um, you, I advanced the clock twice on a ten plus. And, wonderful. Uh, now I just have to find. Well, first I have to escape from jail, but then I have to find, you know, uh, Winter's like most prized possessions and dance on 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 the flame, flaming, uh, burning re re rests. <laughs> Yeah. Okay. Uh, 
so uh i i think before we uh 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 before we do the second part which is uh uh infiltrating and stealing something valuable from the uh uh from the oh, yeah. uh, facility i think that's... um something else yeah. yeah uh let me see uh i i I'm kind of for me it's sort of a toss up for uh whether we uh see what uh winter's doing or see what uh, uh we can do winter or or what uh Kitsunui's doing. Uh do you guys have a have an opinion? I don't mind. Uh go with winter. I If after winter we go to um, Shy's jail time, I might make an appearance there. Okay. Oh. Cool. Sweet. I love it. Okay, so... Uh, winter. The, uh, mm-hmm. you, you, you successfully capture the, the, these, uh, the, these uh, anarchist terrorists uh, but as you do, their their ship takes off and starts uh, uh, strafing uh, uh, important facilities the, uh, containing uh, information that you need to keep organized. It, it, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Maybe maybe there's just like a secondary giant leaf blower on the bottom of the ship that's just like going through the streets. <laughs> yeah, I think it's it's just like using the 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 yeah. uh, exhaust plume, uh, yeah. you know, from the ship to cause havoc. Yeah. I mean, I, I'm like... like a- I'm... angling the ship in such a way that... <laughs> yeah. Le- leaving an actual, like, dirt trail everywhere. I'm, I'm, like, standing there watching this on a monitor, tapping my little paw, like, looking really angry. And then I'm, like, snap my fingers, and I'm, like, bring her in, bring her in. And then, like, shackled up in, like, manacles, like, head to toe. Like, they drag it, like, probably, like, six or seven weasels are, like, dragging you in, Shia. <laughs> and I'm, like, what is this? What, what... What have you done? What are you doing? I I look at this. uh, Do do you still have the feed on in the background where my ship is like wreaking havoc? Yeah, yeah, it's causing mayhem. Yeah, you you see, you see me me look at that and 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 just be not appreciatively nice. Yeah, yeah. Like uh, you, you like my little present that I left for you. Driving that ship, we caught everyone. Who's on that ship? I mean, you thought you did. I'm lying out of my ass, of course, because I don't know who the hell is on that ship. Yeah. <laughs> like, what are you even doing here? Where did you come? You haven't, you haven't talked to me in like two years, and now you show up to wreck my shit? What's going on? I, I, I felt like poking you. <laughs> you felt like poking me? Do you know what I'm? Do you know what I'm doing today? And I'm like gesture to screen, and there's like you know a bunch of like spy cameras looking at a scene. <laughs> I'm kind of busy right now. <laughs> she, she 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 shrugs. It doesn't go very easily because of all the like chains and everything. Yeah. But like a, a shoulder moves a little bit. <laughs> yeah, it like taps his little weasel foot and goes like, "Tell you what." Yeah, like I, I woke up this morning and I just I had this plan and it was gorgeous and it involved a giant leaf blower and you know I just went with it. You know, I, I I'll, I'll make you a deal. If you stop that ship from causing ha- havoc, if you give me the the command code so we can hack it, then um, we will let you go after a moderate amount of paperwork has been filled. <laughs> moderate. <laughs> uh, so is this a seducer manipulate? Yeah, I feel like it is. Um, <laughs> or maybe even a, maybe even like a deceive because I'm like I'm not sure I'm being honest here. Like I'm I'm definitely <laughs> lying like to some degree. So yeah, probably a seducer manipulate. Um, okay. Yeah, I feel like a deceive wouldn't matter because I feel like normally she'd say no because she's just appreciating this handiwork. Like the yeah. the way they use the exhaust fumes to wreak havoc. I mean that's brilliant. So, but you know, you could always try to seduce or manipulate her into doing it. Well, I mean, I mean, she's definitely manipulate yeah. would work the best. 
Deceive definitely falls in uh, falls under the category of seducer manipulator. I mean, right. it, okay. it, it includes fast talk lie. Yeah. All right. So, yeah. Well, that's why. So I believe it's just. Do you guys, by the way, hear my uh, air blowing thing? Nope. My ventilator. No. Okay. Cause it makes a ton of noise here, but my microphone seems to do the noise cancellation thing pretty well. Alright. A 12. Ooh. Very yes. 12. Yeah. I, I think what happens then is is just the fact that I really appreciate it, but I want to be there, right? Mm -hmm. Nobody yeah. goes to stealing my thunder like that. <laughs> okay, yeah. well, uh, there are some specifics out the move when, when used on another uh, uh, okay. PC. Yeah. Uh, sure. So, uh, you, uh, essentially the way it works is that, uh, if you, uh, uh, comply and give the, the codes, um, you'll get to mark experience, um, and then if you don't comply, uh, whatever you do that's going against it, uh, you have to do, you have to act under pressure. Um, but you can do whatever you want. I mean, yeah, no, I'll, I'll give the codes. Right. No, I, I feel like uh, Shy, even though she's pretty stubborn, she's fairly easily manipulated if you present the information well, right? If you, you, you can pretty easily use that stubbornness against her by presenting things from a different angle and being like... Uh, you know, unless you don't think you have the skills to hack it, right? Something along mm. those lines, and then uh, she, she, yeah. she gets coded. Yeah, I, I mean, I, th I think Winter knows you well enough to, like, you know, after, after that oh, yeah. sort of initial, initial rant, you start saying, oh, you know, at least, um, what was the name of your rival on the, your planet? Oh, um, uh, right. Um, let me scroll down here. Lycan? Like like yeah. Lycan. Yeah. yeah, so I think Winter sort of like takes a deep breath and goes, well, you know, I haven't talked much with Lycan, but I feel like this is something definitely like he wouldn't be able to do. You know, he wouldn't be able to give up his ship in order to save his own pride. Like, are you saying that you're as good as him? Or as bad as him? <laughs> Fine, give me a computer. I'll do it. You know? Yeah. Um, I mean, they're like un unchackled. He's all like... so incompetent, really. Seriously. Uh, yeah. They, they loosen up your shackles so you can like move your arms around. Um, and then you get like a keyboard. Um, so you can, <laughs> you know. Yeah. So, and you start putting in the codes. Uh, now. Uh, Kitsune. Uh. uh... Yeah, I was going to do it later, but let's wreak some havoc here. Okay. <laughs> um, so I have many bodies, which yeah. is a, a move that allows me to just butt into other people's sins, which is cool. <laughs> um, so uh, I have a city-sized group of bodies sharing some aspect of my neural architecture. Uh, and at least one of those bodies is a part of every population in the star system when I w wish to be a part of a system that uh, wouldn't otherwise include me, I can roll plus focus to try to be there. So let's try that. All right. I mean, I, th I think you actually have a few bodies, right? You have like the weaseled we buried uh, with the brain chips, right? Like, <laughs> you, know, like yeah. you, you yeah. could totally just like, Go full on zombie and burst out of the grave with these bodies. <laughs> <laughs> so, but I fail every roll, uh, so it's pointless. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> well, okay. Uh, let's uh, let's look at that. Oh, I, I still. Now on a failure, you're still there, right? There's just disadvantages or something. Uh, I get to choose between a few of them. Uh, between not being there or a disadvantage, right? Um, I can't okay. remember uh, reading that in the in the PDF I, or I not the PDF the the document. So I can I can choose a PC gets plus one ongoing against me 
uh, in that scene. So I think I'm picking that because there's no there's too many PCs in here already, and I don't have a don't want to make a relevant NPC necessarily. Okay. Uh, um, so I I think that uh, I I think that what what that probably looks like is that. Uh, you have uh, like a, a, a you know a, a we another weasel agent, uh, but uh, again that one's being tracked as well. Uh, so when uh, 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 when they enter the room, uh, Winter, you immediately know that oh that that's the one that that we that that's the other one that we've been uh, yeah. keeping an eye on. Yeah, there, there's there's like a voice in my calm that's like you know letting me know what's going on, um, <laughs> and I and I think like um, I I sort of like very quickly like because again there's like t ten little like security weasels around uh, like the chain up body of uh, chain up shot. Maybe it's yeah, and one I think of it's... them actually. Yeah, yeah, Maybe it could... it's one of the guards, and you just get the you have something in your room that uh, allows you to detect neural links mm -hmm. so when i activate it it immediately yeah, pops yeah. up as maybe because of all the data we've been stealing from you we've like learned to analyze like your digital brainwave brainwave patterns so when you send out like the signal to this body like we know that you're remotely like accessing him okay so uh winter you know that uh they're there but uh kitsune what do you want to do Oh, I, I want to attack Shai because I, I'm controlling one of Winter's guards and it seems like the normal thing to do here because I want her to... Um, I want her to stay on the planet a bit longer and this is being way too diplomatic for what I think Shai should do. <laughs> <laughs> um. Okay. So, you... so is that before or after they untied my hands? I'll, I'll, I'll uh, it's it's after. It's uh, as I I think like the link was being established already, and it's uh, when I see a uh... huh when I see a moment that you could actually fight back. Now, now you gave me another option, which is I just give you a gun. <laughs> <laughs> which is a better option, actually. <laughs> yeah, I, I want to arm shy then. <laughs> okay. Um, yeah, I don't think that requires a roll. I... Uh, uh, so, uh, like, okay. the... um, I, I, I guess that depends. Um, is, I mean, Winter, so you, you have been monitoring this. Uh, is this, mm -hmm. uh, uh, I, uh, is this something that you would be, you think you would be al alert to yeah. and, and want to, like, immediately interfere with, uh, so, or? So, I, I think because of the way we, we think, right, like, we're very much, like, about being subtle about things and so we we have switched all the bullets in the gun of that specific agent to blanks right <laughs> and so so like there is very little threat from this uh click agent. no like blank bullets right you can shoot them but uh -huh. nothing happens yeah exactly um, and then um then, like, uh, the, there is, like, a few members of his team that are aware that he is compromised, and so they're ready to sort of apprehend him at any time, at, like, a moment's notice. Okay. Um, I think I just want to be, like, very prepared for whatever is going to happen, but I want to see what's, you know, going to happen. Okay. Uh, so, I'm thinking rather than... Uh... Uh, well, there's a, there's a couple of different ways we can handle this. Um, we could just, 
Katsuna, you could act under pressure to have have uh, uh, have uh, gotten on top of this situation and and actually uh, you know changed out the blanks of the gun, um, or uh, it could be it could be some sort of organizational move. Um, like uh, yeah, roll uh, such as uh, just rolling uh, infiltrate in that you're uh, uh, yes they're aware of you but you have uh, uh, actually no not infiltrate I, I think uh, uh, it could be a, a steal something valuable to, in order to uh, have a working gun rather than a broken gun. Uh, I think it's probably one of those two, uh, but if you have other ideas, then uh, feel free. Uh, could it also be Format Rebellion? Um, uh, I think that would be a different move. That that's okay. like Or the... just grab somebody's gun, who who does have a gun, in case I mean, which yeah. would be a, yeah, probably yeah, a direct that... attack. Yeah, yeah, totally. So yeah. there's at least like three options. Um. Sure, I'll go with the. Uh, I have minus one on pretty much everything, so <laughs> <laughs> that I could use. Um, I I think this this is not so much of an organizational move. I think this is uh somewhere in the in the hold of uh. In the back of Kitsun's mind, there's a direct link to to this guy, and this is a a personal thing. So this is act under pressure to um, I don't know keep control of uh, all of Kitsun's assets, like body assets. Right, as expected. No, <laughs> that's what, what is right? this? Like, what are you? What What are your roles? Hey, he got experience, okay. though. Yeah, I leveled up. Yeah, that, that was my goal for the session. So yeah, yeah. <laughs> that's impressive. Okay. Uh, uh, so, so it's... let me see. Uh, uh, so I think what happens. Is that uh, uh, you? Uh, you know, blow your cover. Give uh, Shy the, uh, the the gun, and yet it is indeed uh, filled with blanks. Yeah, I mean, so I think unless Shy you shoot me immediately, uh, there's like a moment where you hold a gun pointing it at me, and I want to like do do that. I don't know. I'm not pointing it at you. Um, what I try to do is, like, I look at, like, this, all this hardware in this room, right? And I try to identify, okay, if I, if I shoot that piece of wood there, will it blow up the room? And then I point at, you know, at, at that piece of hardware and click, and then I'm, like, look down disappointed. And then I turn, like, the gun around and try to just whack it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I mean, I, I think definitely there's going to be a bunch of weasels jumping on you trying to stop you. <laughs> <I imagine. laughs> and I'm I'm tied up, right? So yeah. it's, it's not going to go very easy. Uh, but, you know, yeah. I'm going to try and blow us all up. Okay. Uh... Hmm. Yeah, I, uh... I think... I think that's gonna be well. Okay, you're you're trying to uh, damage property, not. Uh, uh, but you are trying to. Uh, uh, oh, no, I don't care so much about. Property. Yeah, I just. So, I just want to do something crazy and blow them up, and you know myself in the process too. But whatever. Okay. Are you, uh, you, maybe use force. Yeah, use force. Uh, and I I think this is the the situation is pretty bad. So. Uh, yeah. Uh, at a, uh, uh, I, I guess I'm gonna, just gonna like apply a minus one rather than having you uh, act under pressure before you can use force, which would be the like the the more. Sure, uh, I mean you can even standard. go for a minus two because not only am I tied up, but he's got an army of weasels around me, right? Yeah. 
Um, yeah, yeah. Come to think of it, yeah. Go ahead and do act under pressure to uh, to get to, just to be able to use force. Sure. Uh, so how do I do that? Okay. So uh, luckily they're both badass. Uh, so okay. uh, roll badass for the act under pressure. Okay. Seven. Um. So. Uh, you uh, uh, stumble, hesitate, or flinch, uh, or I could offer a uh, essentially a devil's bargain. Ooh. I mean, <laughs> br bring it. <laughs> uh, so I I think there's a. Uh, The, uh, the I think there's the opportunity here for uh, you uh, hmm I, I mean, go ahead uh, yeah I have a suggestion it's that while she's been in this room physically I've had like a little like hacker in the corner trying to like um like sort of hack her like personal data storage on her person and she realizes at the same time that like your personal information is being compromised and so you can like crush it and not let us get the data or you can you know do this thing which is going to make everything or attempt to make everything explode something like that maybe yeah yeah um so yeah you can either <sighs> Uh, you can either go ahead and uh, still just attempt to uh, blow up this component that that uh, uh, that may blow up the room. Like it, it, you'd have to, mm -hmm. uh, yeah. you'd need a pretty good result on the use force uh, to do it. I imagine. Uh, or you can avoid being uh, uh, like automatically uh, infiltrated back at home. Um, I by, mean, by you know, so blow stuff up. But when, when there is, like, Brad, when, when there is a choice between <laughs> blowing stuff up and something else, there is not a choice. <laughs> That's not how it works. All right. Do you have a belief about it? You shouldn't... <laughs> <laughs> I, I mean, you know, we're, we're not playing Burning Wheel here, <laughs> but yeah, totally. Um, well, well, instinct, when when anything blow up yeah. stuff. <laughs> well, you do have a, uh, a fault. Uh, it's tactless, though. That doesn't really apply. Okay. No. Not quite. Um, so go ahead and uh, roll Badass again uh, to uh, use for I am going to blow this place up. No, I'm not. God damn it. Did you replace that thing? Did you know this was coming, Winter? Uh, yeah. Maybe, <laughs> maybe the gun is actually, like, there's, like, a remote in my hand or a present, and it just, like splits into like pieces right like it just disassembles it. itself <laughs> and i'm like and i stand there like grinning with my like weaselly smile and i'm like i knew that was happening i knew it yeah, i know this big red yeah. button that says do not touch yeah. it, it i mean it looks like oh yeah that thing's gonna totally blow this place up but it yeah yeah, yeah actually when, when when i hit the but do not touch button that's what disassembles the gun yeah. <laughs> right. So I, I essentially do it myself. Like, you yeah, just yeah, predicted yeah. everything. And I just I like, rub my little paws together. He's like, yes, all according to <laughs> plan. <laughs> um, so, uh, we're just about out of time. Um, is there any, uh, like, final thing that somebody really wants to do? I want to give an ultimatum to, to stop that ship or I'm going to EMP it to the ground. Okay. <laughs> Well, you do have the codes, like that. Yeah. That happened. I mean, I could, I could set like the some of the weaponry to self-destruct, right? 
Yeah, I prefer to keep the ship in one piece. I think like I could just have tur- like I can overload the guns or like turn it off so it just falls out of the sky. But like I think I'll give the ultimatum of like land and give yourself up for a rest, or we're going to drop you out of the sky. Um. Okay. Winter. Why is it boring? Why not just blow it up? <laughs> Not everything is about blowing everything up, Shia. I tried to teach you this. <laughs> yes, it is. Sometimes Gosh, you just feel as boring as you used so, to be. So, and my response is, uh, uh, the agent uh, is going to pretend to be like one of Shia's men or personnel. He's like, Long live Shy in the revolution! We'll pull this planet off. I, I, I think it's We're like coming for you, shy. And I just full I, speed ram into the uh, his. Um, I, I'm assuming we know where his building is, where <laughs> where he's at now, and we, we're just gonna slam like full throttle and like throw all the self destruct uh, mechanisms. I, I, like her, her ship is like a missile, I guess. Yeah. We know that, yeah, so. basically. Yeah, as, okay. as Winter hears so, that, he just pushes yeah. one button. Uh, so let me see. This is uh, this is an NPC that's in, uh, that's in the crosshairs, but they're one of uh, they're like a, a loyal agent of uh, uh, of uh, thirty four sixty eight. So, um. He could probably self uh Kenny, is there objection? I don't know. Yeah, I would, uh, ask. would they have safety procedures in the ship? <laughs> probably not. <laughs> D- doubtful. Yeah. Uh, so yeah, I, I I think just roll the the give ultimatum and uh, yeah. you know you you may be to impress them with the idea that uh, it would be be okay. Um, Give so I choose one, uh, yeah. and uh, I, I I think that yeah they they do they they do exactly as as you said uh uh, uh thirty four sixty eight um the um they they they're all uh long live the rebellion and the the ship is, is as they're coming in hit with a, a number of uh you know uh defensive cannon um but they they do get a, an opportunity to uh try to uh uh ram the structure and blow everything up um that could be uh continue to the, that that could be uh Direct conflict? Yeah. Okay. That's it's fine with me. The final tick in my clock. <laughs> is, this what, is, this what, is this what sinks the nail in the worst day of well, my life? Uh, <laughs> otherwise, or continue undermining or not? No. Uh, yeah, I mean, you can do it as... Well, okay, let me... Let me see. Because uh, she already op- uh, instituted the Direct conflict. All I'm doing is continuing her ultimatum, right? Um, when the clock is targeted on those like she already been established, you continue to apply pressure in some degree. Um, I think this is this is pretty unsubtle. Okay. I think this is direct conflict. Okay, that's cool. I was trying to weasel that in, so I don't have to roll <laughs> minus, but you know, it's what it is. Uh, okay. That is for that. I mean, you should you should leave the weaseling to Ted. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, you know. Hey, weaseling, it's okay. So I got a one. Not as good, but actually, I think I got a zero. No, I think I got a zero. Hold on a second. I think I have a zero because I have um, I minus one control because I have. Uh, Okay, so I got a zero. Okay. Oh yeah, by the way, um, didn't I fail a roll? So wouldn't my people have done something crazy? 
Um, they were all around. I don't think it was a, it, was it an organization role? I thought. Oh uh, uh, no no no! It was just me trying to shoot, blow us up. So. Okay. She's not that organized. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, that's uh, the the ship is totally going to hit and uh, blow things up. Um, and uh, and uh, I I think uh. Well, okay. So, yeah, the ship hits uh, the, the structure. Um, I'll go ahead and advance that clock to... Uh, no! To all the way! <laughs> yeah. Um, and, yeah, let, uh, do you guys uh, have enough time to do to handle the fallout of this, or do we want to just narrate it? Because... Uh, There'd be a number of roles involved, but uh, if you want to just like finish it up and, and, uh, and so because and like um, okay, I'm pretty okay with narrating it. Yeah, yeah. I'm okay with that. Narrating is fine. Go ahead. Okay. It's um, up to you. Tell us the story. <laughs> so the. Uh, the structure uh, caves in, and there, there's like the, this uh, explosion that that uh, uh, creates uh, shock waves out for like for uh, kilometers, and it even destroys some of the underbrush. Uh, <laughs> that, that's wow. a huge explosion. <laughs> uh, everybody on site uh, uh, dies. And wakes back up, uh, uh, you know, at uh, you know, uh, at home or at a, you know another facility. <laughs> um, this incenses uh, Winter's people and the um, those who Anarchy. yes, uh, uh, th those who uh, worshipped. Uh, uh, Shabnogroth and just were able to embrace the chaos, uh, gain a, a, a true foothold and establish uh, their their own uh, government on the planet. Uh, so uh, causing th this uh, schism. Um, so uh, if we were uh, playing further sessions of this. Uh, Winter, you'd get to uh, go through the the, the uh, schism mechanic and uh, possibly uh, choose some new descriptors for your uh, uh, for your civilization, and, and it would uh, get one smaller, um, down to like city sized, uh, and uh, I, I think that uh, like. Uh, uh, Special circumstances and the powers that be are uh, um, pretty piss pissed off at uh, how this uh, uh, went down. Thirty four sixty eight. They're, I mean, they, you know, they don't have final say over your organization, so you can still do what you want. Um, but uh, I think that uh, the. Uh, uh, you know, they are what is what is the your organization's want? Um, hold on. Uh, I think. Um, uh, I think it was um. I don't remember what okay. it was. Yeah, uh, I'm not. I'm not seeing it. And that that may be my fault. I'll, I'll have to like check back over the sheets to make sure that uh, uh, okay. there is like a, a directive to choose a uh, a surplus and want for the uh, regional intelligence. Um, so is that anyway, like that, that's party? totally activated. So uh, uh, there there's uh, some sort of mechanical r rancor within your your. Uh, 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 within your organization over this, 
uh, you know, it doesn't like cause a schism by itself, but it, there, there's like trouble. Um, and uh, I, I think that, uh, but in the wake of this, uh, Kitsune, there, there's like this, this uh, there's this totally easy opportunity for uh, your uh, other agent, even though they're being monitored, to, to uh, uh, go in and grab that the, the DNA back. Um, uh, although it has been uh, uh, altered and played with, so it, it may have uh, 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 negative consequences when it actually gets back to you. Uh, if we were doing further sessions, we we would definitely do something fun with that. Uh, That's fine. I <laughs> so would be planting it on an agent anyway. Uh, that sounds fun, man. That sounds great. We all get kind of screwed a little bit. Uh, so cool. I, I'm uh, uh, I'm glad we are actually able to come to like a. a, a, a a pretty solid resolution solid like resolution. Uh, uh, in uh, past sessions like the the character creation part has taken so much time that uh, there there wasn't really time to get to do more than like get things started um, which is you know mostly because the the character sheets are, are, are let a lot more involved than a, a standard one um, but uh, thank you guys so much for playing um, thank you for running if you have uh, thanks, uh, if you ha or you're welcome. Uh, if you have any comments on like uh, the the flow of the game or any uh, uh, you know any flaws that stand out to you, I I would definitely like to know. Well, I I enjoyed the 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 whole PvP thing that that seemed to work pretty well. Yeah, I think this kind of. Um... Actually, first of all, okay, you're doing a great job. This is actually something that is needed. Um, the idea of having uh, players rule over organizations and be able to uh, kind of branch out through NPCs within the organization, I think it's pretty cool. Thank you. Uh, yeah, and I like that a lot. I think you, you made some decent moves for that. Uh, maybe try to... F I, I don't know what your goal with the with this project is. Because uh, I imagine that you wanted... There's some specific part of uh, role-playing games that you're trying to fix or improve upon. Um. Uh, if well, I, I'm not sure if I'd call it uh, fixing like role-playing games in general. I think that that's way too ambitious. Uh, but I, I, I no, certainly, but okay. yeah, I, I'm, I'm looking to create uh, to create a space for a style of play that uh, 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 fills that uh, that that's like the uh, sandboxy. Uh, epic, but uh, you know, again, uh, uh, very much tied into people's uh, uh, personal, uh, uh, you know, agendas and foibles, um, as, as well as uh, uh, making uh, making good use of a uh, uh, more of a uh, zoomed out style. Um, and uh, you know the sessions have, have gone you know a little bit back and forth as to uh, how the the degree of zoom like this I, I was uh, a little bit more moment than moment than uh, some of the others but I, I it felt fairly successful uh, me um, so I, I don't know did, did, did that answer your uh... <laughs> I don't know if it's even a question, but it, did it address uh, fully address your comment? Yeah, I think it. That, that's what I'm saying is there are 
when I say fixed role playing games, it's in the sense that I think everyone that's trying to make a new role playing game is because there's something that they've tried to do in another one and figured out that the system didn't help. And having a more zoomed out uh, options is not something that exists in most systems. And the ones that do exist are not necessarily good at it. Uh, so I think if you're aiming for that, you're doing a good job. Uh, and because it's more of a zoomed out large organizations thing, I think PVP is the best way to go because each player already has himself and the, and the NPCs that work for them. Uh, yeah, but the, yeah. And I think, uh, because, uh, yeah, I definitely, Brad, we, uh, last time you did have more fun. Uh, sorry to cut you off there, sir. But, um, but, fun, uh, yeah, but, yeah, we definitely did more, had fun on the last session when we teach you too. Because it felt like we had a purpose then. Because when we were fighting a single entity, we could never get on track together mm -hmm. to work against that entity. But when we we're, like, messing with each other, we had more to do with with that, you know, because we knew each other's bonds, we knew everybody, and I think this game was best for that, in a way. Cool. Cool. Um, uh, I, I would say I, I would like to see more specific moves about how to uh, deal with your own people. Uh, or maybe you have them and we just haven't used them that much. Uh, because uh, both me and Leo were put in in a position that we kind of took control of an NPC, but not really because it's... An, so there should yeah. be a specific move that dictates how much control over an NPC we have if it, the NPC is within our own faction. That, that's my opinion. Just to make it more streamlined and not put the onus of uh, deciding how much is too much on you as GM, have actually a role involved in how much we can push our own NPCs. Well, yeah, but yeah. the thing is, is uh, on a uh, only problem with that is because you're a uh, a single entity, basically. Your, uh, you know, um, composition, um, kind of like a hive. Yes. Line, you know, it's kind of, but and for me, it it feels a little bit less clunky, but for the other uh, playbooks. I, I mean, think... that could just differ per class, right? Yeah, it could. Yeah. That, that's what I'm saying. It, it should be a little bit more fleshed out, in my opinion. If if yeah, that yeah. if your ask is what do I think uh, you should uh, look at next? I think this is the part that you should. Okay, cool. Thank you. Um, yeah, like uh, the, I think there's uh, there, there's some structure for it, and definitely for the the citizen, but but probably not enough. I I definitely want to take another look at that. Uh, Thanks. Oh yeah, like I just didn't use it. I I, I saw that there was stuff, uh, there, but you know, my people just do what they want anyway. So. <laughs> cool. Okay. How so... to micromanage anarchists? Yes. <laughs> uh, so uh, thanks again, everybody. I I really appreciate you you uh you guys playing uh especially on you know. Uh, Somewhat short notice, a uh, very short notice for you, Ted. Thanks again. Yeah. Um, no problem. It was fun. So I will probably. Be, uh, I'm not sure what I'm going to be doing uh, 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 next week. Whether I'm going to try and organize another game or just do uh, just uh, work on the the game. You know, work on writing the game on stream or or what. And I, I don't know what you guys' availability is. Um, but, uh, I'll, uh, you know, 
if I decide to go for it, I, I will let you know, and you'll have the option of yes or no. It's okay if you uh, uh, can't make it. Um, yeah. And uh, I'm going to... Uh, oh, oh. Uh, does anybody have any uh, shout-outs? Uh, Leo, I, I, you, you, do, uh, you do some stuff online. Yeah, uh, you can follow me at WizardDonna. Twitter is my um, handle, and uh, just follow me there. I pretty much update that anytime we play a game on, on YouTube, uh, my friend's YouTube channel, as well as updates on what I'm doing in life. So take a look at that. That's pretty much the best place to see what I'm up to. Um, Sundays, of course, I'm here, and if... Uh, Last month, one the day, Department of day. Labor alleged... I will enjoy the brain wheel with our Lord and Savior. <laughs> <laughs> the DM over here. I'm already buttering you up, by the way. <laughs> <laughs> you don't kill my character right off the bat. No, I was um, but, um, so I, hopefully more times playing with Brad, so... Yeah. Um, I... I looking forward to that as well and uh who knows smoke it may even survive tomorrow <laughs> in chaos uh does does anybody else have any uh shout outs i didn't okay. uh i think the only thing that you can find of mine on the internet are weird physics papers so <laughs> i wouldn't in infringe that on people well uh <laughs> That is intriguing, I have to say. Uh, so, I mean, if, if you want to post a link to them, I will be happy to, to uh, repost them into Twitch or whatnot, but if you don't, no, that, 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 that's, that's totally cool. Um, no, that's fine. Okay. Then people will ask me things about them, possibly, and I don't want to <laughs> uh, Cool. Uh, so you can find... Possibly, uh, and I don't my... want to... <laughs> Uh, uh, you can find uh, my stuff uh, here on, on uh, Twitch uh, or on uh, YouTube at uh, youtube.com slash c slash rpglory. Um, if uh, you enjoyed this uh, and are watching uh, like uh, on uh, YouTube or on, uh, uh, on Twitch, please do uh, uh, follow, subscribe, share, like, what whatnot I very much would appreciate it um, and I'm going to look for somebody super cool to host uh, I mean what why why Brad are you never I'm going to find somebody incredibly boring you know S switch it up you're right, you're right. <laughs> uh, what I well, do congratulations is, yeah. Brad on getting uh, your fits your, uh... Oh, thank you. Yes. Um, yeah, I, I am a affiliate. Oh, like for good cool. Real. Uh, not a partner or anything, but an affiliate. Uh, cool. But yeah, next next time, what I'll do is, is I'll choose somebody super cool to host, but I'll call them lame just to <laughs> uh, just to create a, a controversy. Uh, and let's see the uh, oh oh no, it's clearly clearly Tux uh, 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 good choice you must yeah you must check check out Tux uh, he is uh, playing some uh, uh, playing some blades with uh, Kelsa. Who's uh, uh oh. yeah? Who's uh, definitely awesome and a uh, uh, and you can find her. Uh, uh, well, she does a bunch of stuff, but uh, she's on the, <laughs> uh, uh, on this channel on on Wednesdays uh, for uh, the Burning Wind. Uh, so, yeah. <laughs> Thanks again, everybody. Have a good one. Bye. Yeah.